welcome to today's vlog. We're getting started a little bit later, but today's not a normal vlogging day. But because of the news that we got yesterday, I thought maybe we would vlog today because we've got to go do some important things. We for... obviously don't have any important news though. Not really. What kind? What news did we get yesterday that's not very important? No, we have a new match. Yeah. How do you? How are you feeling today? You were a little. You didn't have a very good day yesterday. Okay. So. Look, when you wake me from a deep slumber, <laughs> I'm not the most a alert person, and then I'm <laughs> grumpy the rest of the day. Right. So that's so. why I'm asking. How are you feeling today now that you've had some sleep? much more excited yeah um and i think it, it just you always get like excited like boom, when it happens yeah i have, to, have take to take a little while a little so i have to like think through things that's my i don't know ocd i don't know what causes it but um so we've got to go do all of the stuff that we've already done except again yeah it's kind of like whatever. It's not like anything hard or anything. It's just a little bit expensive, honestly. So <clears throat> we have to go get match forms notarized um, that go back to our agency, just saying that we officially accept the match. Um, we have to wire the rest of the money because this one is a little bit more expensive than the last match was anyways so we've got to go get that stuff done today we are also filming our video tonight and posting on instagram and everything else letting you guys know that we got a new match because most of you do not know in fact i think other than my family <coughs> only two well our family only two people know in addition to that um so, you guys are going to be finding out about that in just a few hours, and I can't wait. That's always my absolute favorite, yeah. because I know that you guys are waiting well, along with us. you guys are us. also so invested in it. Right. So, I mean, obviously it's hard for us, but some of you have been watching since, like, day two or three of right. us vlogging, and... It's been a long road. Like, you've been waiting just as long, yeah. so... So, I'd always get excited. It always, like, makes it more real when we tell you guys, so... Some people wait longer, and at this point, I'm like, we could have literally waited until the day before with the last one, and we still would have had to tell you that it so failed. Disclaimer, so, disclaimer, if something happens and this one fails, I'm sorry, but you'll get to go through it with us, and that's right. what we do. You get our life. Yeah. So. Good morning, guys. Today is a new day. I'm assuming this vlog is kind of going to be like a, our weekend, what we did vlog with a whole bunch of different stuff, including all of the kind of little things that we have to get done once we receive a match um with our agency we have to have things notarized which you guys heard about that yesterday and then um depending on how long it is before the birth and what the birth mom wants um we either have like a conference call with her or like with the last match because it was so quickly um, we had a conference call with her like the next day and then um, we just met her at the hospital. So um, sometimes if the birth mother wants it, uh, the adoptive family will travel to see her and meet her before the birth, um, which we don't have too long. We technically could go up, um, but I don't think that's something that she necessarily feels like she needs or wants. Um, and so we are going to send her a card. Um, we're gonna send it to the agency and then they will forward that to her. So I am going to Target right now to pick up a card. I'm a little bit nervous. I don't know what to say. I always find a hard time knowing what to say or thinking of what to say to these women who ultimately give you the best gift and the biggest gift that anyone could ever give and it's such like a sacrifice on their part and they're doing something because they believe that they're doing it because they want something better for their child than what they can give them I've said it so many times but there's such this like stigma around birth moms that the reason why they're placing their babies for adoption is because they don't care um, and most of the time that's not true I mean if that is how it was then you wouldn't see so many birth moms 
deciding to parent at the last minute. If they truly didn't care about these babies, then how would it, why would it be hard for them to give them up? Um, and so to know what to say to someone who is giving us something that no one else could, we can't give ourselves, we couldn't have it if it were not for them. Um, but it's just kind of hard to know what to say in those moments. And so I don't want to like say the wrong thing or come off in the wrong way or not seem appreciative enough. Um, so I'm going to Target to pick out a card and then I am going to the post office to send the rest of our stuff. And then we're done and we're just waiting. Um, I talked to the birth mother's agency worker yesterday. I sent her an email just to touch base. Um, and she said, that birth mom is waiting for her doctor to schedule an appointment for the gender stuff. So I don't, I've never been pregnant, so I don't know how that goes. So I don't know if we're talking like it could happen early next week or if it's gonna take a couple of weeks or like what kind of the, the deal is with that. I hope that it happens quickly, um, but it may, it may not, I'm not sure. Okay, so we made it to the cards and I don't even know which card to pick. I think maybe like a thinking of you or something. Everything's like birthday and wedding and anniversary and thank you. I mean, I guess that would be okay. I just don't want anything that's like too sappy, I guess. I don't know. So I'm thinking the best bet is going to be to buy one of these blank cards that we can then write in because even the ones that say thinking of you, I don't really care for. So I'm looking at this one that has a hummingbird and then this one that has a peacock. They're so pretty. They have a lot of options that are just blank, which I'm grateful for because I was not sure what I was going to do. But I think that this will be good. Then we can just write whatever we want to say in it and we can just kind of make our own. So I got a card. I wanted to show you guys which one I ended up picking. I love it so much. I've kind of been obsessed with peacocks for a while. Peacocks and flamingos, I love them so much. If I can get it out of the bag, then I'll show you. So I got this one. I think it's so pretty. It has little rhinestones on it and everything. I love it. So I am going to take that back home. I'm going to let Derek fill that out because he has much nicer handwriting than I do. <laughs> so yeah, I always think too much about what we say in things. Like I know with our like video profile and with our print profile, both of those, I like got anxious over both of them and like knowing what to say. I'm excited. I am so excited. It's kind of nice. Like it's hard to have to wait the time. Like 66 days is still 66 days, but it's kind of nice to be able to like experience these things and like being in a time when you don't know the gender and then we're going to find out the gender and then we can plan things and do the nursery and I don't know it's kind of like a condensed pregnancy um like you're not waiting a whole nine months but you also still get to like experience some of those milestones um so that's really cool so we are here at the run disney princess expo because we're running the 10k tomorrow so we had to come and pick up all of our packet stuff and it's one of my favorite things to come and just look at all of the stuff here because i just i don't know i like it a lot and princess weekend is always crazier than some of the other ones princess and star wars are really big um so we're just here looking at all the cool stuff all the princess stuff is this your favorite weekend all the princess stuff oh yeah definitely 